Welcome Raiders to another Raid Shadow Legends video and in this one we're on Candid's account. Uh, this is a new free to play account if we look at uh, the champion roster here. We have some voids basically saved up voids. Um, they haven't pulled any Legos at all void or affinity based. We do have some rares. Uh, they started off with El Hain. We're trying to create an arena team here. Um, we do have some clan boss and some really good dungeon progression champs. We do have some decent faction war and clan boss champs as well. Nothing crazy. We do have an amazing campaign farmer here. So trying to push this account as best as I can. And also, you know, if you're watching a video, uh, just or or if you're watching someone stream, just use your brain, man. Like. I sometimes I get questions that just blow my mind. Like it, it's in the title, it's in the description. Like it, it just blows my mind. If you're playing this game, usually like lower hundred IQ people shouldn't be playing this game. Like what? It, it just I don't know, man. I'm not being toxic. I just I just don't get it. I honestly don't. <laughs> like what? Imagine going to a grocery store and being like, do you guys sell grocery? But whatever. We're progressing this account here. Um, I'm just going through the campaign. Apparently, they elected to do so many different things on the account instead of just going straight through the campaign as fast as they can. Uh, they have been focusing on a little bit of challenges, a little bit of missions and quests. But I'm here to like really just help out the count, focus. I've done a gear cleanse. I definitely told them which champions to, you know, put their investment in. Uh, we're trying to get the arena team next because basically everyone in arena team, even if they're in bronze one, has whole bunch of um, whole bunch of like ninjas, Legos. There's epics. So even this like, this type of account, um, we just get we get wrecked. You know they have to have like super starters, Galek, you know maybe an un uncommon in their team and all rares and maybe one epic. We can actually beat those teams because we have decent champs. Um, and all actually a lot of these champs are not fully geared or fully leveled up. Actually, Zargala's naked, um, and as you can see, still doing okay. I mean we're negative affinity here, but. Who cares? Like the whole point is we're leveling her up and at the same time, um, maybe put out the decreased defense. Right? We're using her aura as the lead. Uh, Hexia is the Hexia, and of course Bella are the main damage he dealers here. They really like uh, Mother Superior, so w w we're we're working with that champion. Wow, <laughs> yay, oh man, let's go. Um, I built out the Bella. Uh, we're using Zergala here because uh, we have like three champions that could put debuffs mother superior technically could use debuffs on the a1 uh, she has what like 22 accuracy so having 62 accuracy on like literally normal campaign is nuts you're always pretty much if it has a high chance to put it you're gonna put it so that's why i elected to go with zargala here in the lead mm. we're gonna be playing this account a lot not me not on uh, stream or anything like that but I'm gonna be helping K with their account a lot as much as I can um, we're gonna to try to see how far we can get in a few months using my knowledge right I know you guys wanted me to do a free-to-play series and I never got really the chance to do it and at this rate I probably never will even though I really want to man bad elves cuz are getting that 30% extra healing is nuts dude but Hexia put good work into him got him killed all right next one Hey, we got a free uh, um, rare skill tome, which we need, because they actually the went crazy and leveled up the full. They fully booked Mother Superior, so <whistles> so yeah, she heals pretty good, right? Uh, let's go with the We could, we could, we could do this. Yeah, we could go back to the simple team we we're using. Uh, they have a lot of energy, and we have a decent amount of gems too. I think. Um, we gotta get masteries on these champions. There's just not enough mas like there's no one really mastered other than just like, you know, the crit rate or a little bit of attack. But we need to get full. If we can get full masteries, 
they've just been wondering on which champs to 60 of course who's the who's the targets things like that um but honestly i don't want to master anybody if i don't have to i don't want to do anything like that waste energy on that that's just a waste of time same thing with gearing if i don't have to gear i won't i did a free to play account way back um i posted a video about it in 24 hours how far can you get with uh with a brand new account and this is not brand new unfortunately usually a brand new account has like a few hundred energy but you never you never go down because of the how much they're giving like you literally like a wave i had like over i think i had over like 400 energy infinitely and my and my silver when i first started was like 400k and then i got it to like two mil within a few hours um and you can keep it there uh, we used a lot of our silver. We had three million. We used a lot on on the on the uh, Bellower and Hexia. But I did do a gear cleanse, so that might help out a little bit. And you know what? I I normally put it at the end or in the middle, but I'm just gonna randomly put. The key word just randomly. You'll never know now. You'll have to watch the whole thing. And I should make it hour long videos just to torture you guys because of one person. But it shouldn't be fair, right? That one person should uh, ruin it for everybody. I've never understood that champion. Like. Yeah, he can decrease your speed, but he literally just makes himself annoying. Like, that's all he does. <laughs> and not annoying in the sense of like, oh, he's going to kill me. More like annoying like, now you're just prolonging the fight. You know I'm going to win. You know, that die, that type of champ, champ that you're just like, ah, oh, just die. I'm going to be trying to put out more videos. I, I know I've been behind both on streaming and on YouTube, guys. I have just been super busy. My birthday's coming up. There's a lot of things happening in December. I was supposed to move out of my apartment. And now with all this new stuff, I might be staying. It's been kind of uh, ups and downs. But um, hopefully starting next year in January after taxes, I will be able to probably start start working primary full-time youtube and twitch hopefully we'll see i can't guarantee that but that's that's kind of like what i'm pushing towards i would love to just you know play raid all the time i mean people can get sick and tired of it but not me honestly i've just been doing it nonstop for two years and i actually love coaching teaching people how to play the game and to you know the early stands the early parts of the game i will say that the early parts are fun but they're not as fun because it's more of it's a huge struggle it's a huge struggle that you try to overcome like this wall but the wall is because of if you don't have the knowledge if you know all the techniques and this and the tricks you can literally bypass a lot of things in this game and and utilizing your resources correctly as well So yeah, like uh, we're, we're, I'm gonna push this campaign uh, all all the way. Hopefully, we can get to like hard, maybe like hard halfway. If I get like blocked halfway through hard, then I'm probably gonna stop and start. They have been farming dragon because of the times two dragon to drop. Um, so I'm I'm actually happy for, I'm actually happy for that <laughs> because I want to do I'm trying to farm dragon as well on my main account, like trying to get a massive amounts of speed gear, you know. Um, doing stage 25 like crazy as well and yeah I actually have my dragon 25 team on my phone as we speak if it would click my team Jesus Christ <laughs> look <laughs> so I'm playing on the phone at the same time yes fight the dragon thank you this dragon I'm surprised this dragon hasn't shown their face in this game again you think they would put this boss back in the game whoa whoa, whoa. it's trying to sell five star gear whoa whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoops ulti multi battles is gonna go crazy for a second there you go 
This boss can be really annoying, um, cause like that passive, that passive, the A2, putting decreased speed and decreased accuracy is just nuts. And then that passive of reflecting, if you don't have life steal, you literally die. Or if you don't have a healer, you just kill yourself. Like over, the, over and over, like it's really hard. Uh, but luckily we have Mother Superior here keeping us alive. Um, it's really strong, really strong, uh, rare. For the early game. So it looks like we're actually going to beat this on our first try. So that was pretty cool. Oh man, nice. Chapter 10 already. Look how fast we're progressing. Um, we're going to continue using the same team. The key word is Hexia. So we're um, chilling, you know, progressing the dungeons here. Uh, I mean the campaign here. And I think we're going to be able to beat this easy on my first try. So, yeah, that's going to be pretty nice. Even if we don't, I can switch out some people for affinities. Um, they'll, make, they'll make things a lot easier, right? That Devastator is really strong. But yeah, Raiders, I think that's it. I think we're going to stop it here. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Uh, yeah, just check out the titles. Check everything out. And... Uh, going to upload the other one. Man, we're almost done, right? We're getting closer to the giveaway, so... Bye, Raiders.